This is the Hendricks College Men's Soccer Coaches Show. I'm Eric Holt. I'm here with the uh, head coach, Jeff Trimble. You guys fought to a 3-3 draw with Rhodes on this past weekend. Talk a little bit about that for us, coach. Well, obviously, when you get a score, it's an exciting game. I mean, you know, and, and it's a game that, that uh, I was very proud of the guys. They played very, very well, um, very hard, actually. They, uh, we got down there. Um, Rhodes is a good opponent. It's on the road. Um, and they scored first. And that's you know you're never really sure how your team's going to respond. We've had a lot of close games that we've lost. And we've had a lot of close games we've lost in overtime. So you have that in the back of your mind when it's 1-0 and it's starting to get down to late in the game. We were able to generate a goal, um, and our forward got the ball was able to to make some people miss and cross the ball into one of our players who came and, and finished it. And so that was exciting to get it to one to one. And I think maybe five minutes later the defenders were. Passing the ball around in the back, and we stole the pass and went on a breakaway to make it two to one. And I think we had them stunned a little bit there. You know, there was I think 30 minutes left in the game. We're up two to one, and so now it's a matter of just trying to keep the guys playing. Really, too, there's too much time just to kill the game off at that point. We have to wait for a few, and and we did a good job. We kept playing. We got it down um, to about I think it was almost nine minutes left in the game, and they had a player who on throw-ins could when he threw the ball into threw it, throw it into the box which is very, very dangerous. And they, they were doing that on us, and I think it was, um, they generated some offense, and, and were able to play a ball head off the wing, and got a breakaway, and we just didn't do well defensively, and they tied the game. And then sure enough, four minutes later, I think, I don't know, there was only a few minutes left on the clock, and their player had to throw and got up there and threw it in, and they, we just got beat for the ball in the air. And now it's three to two. You know, they score on that play, and now it's, it's Coaches say it's gut check time, but it really is, I think, time for us to see if we're going to be discouraged or can we keep being positive and keep working, you know, working forward. And um, sure enough, the guys generated a great chance late in the game. 18 seconds left. Jacob Pierce had a, a direct kick right outside the 18. Um, took a great shot on goal, and their goalkeeper deflected it over. And now the significant part of the game happens. Our players, instead of hanging their heads and just kind of wandering around, one of them just goes to the sprints and gets um, the, ball boy, the ball boy to give him a ball. Sets it down in the corner, and now you're hearing the announcer go 10, 9, you know, because it means the way they have to count down to the 10 seconds left. And we play a corner, and, and they miss clear, miss clear, and Jacob Pierce finds it and sticks it in the back of the net with two seconds left um, to make it 3-3. And you know that's exciting. We did the three three. Now we got to play two ten minutes. Sudden death overtimes. They had a great chance in one that we cleared off. Um, basically the line. Larry, uh, actually one of our defenders, actually did a great job deflecting it out. And then we did. We had a great, great opportunity late, and um, didn't obviously didn't, didn't make it. But at three three, um, it was. There's good bads and ties. Bad ties. That was a very good tie. Um, uh, it was a very good result for us, coming off of uh, a rough couple of results leading up to this, the first conference game on the road, it, it being Rhodes, which a lot of people say are our rivals, you know, I was very, very proud of the boys. Uh, lots of overtime games this year for the men. How, how are they handling that as a team? Handling it better. I think there is a sense, in which I was very scared about, there's a sense that something bad's going to happen, you know, because we had some, some bizarre deflections. and giveaways and sometimes we're shooting ourselves in the foot with some of this stuff and so I think they thought maybe that was destiny and that was going to happen every time and so that's why that Rhodes results with result was nice because we worked hard and we got a decent result. And uh, Saturday Millsaps comes in it's the SAA home opener yeah. lots of fans yeah. should be at that game talk about it for us. It's coach. exciting it's going to be an exciting game um, the girls will play first at one the boys us boys will play at three um, they're a very good team I mean, just flat out. They're a very good team. They had a good record, good results last, last year. Um, it was a closer game last year. The one thing I like about the guys is we, we tend to, if you look at our results, make some games close. And um, we're going to have to play play good soccer, but we're getting some players back off of injury. So it, it should be a fun game. All right, Coach, thank you very much. Thank you.